Hello family, today I'm bringing you an offer from BDK, BDK Parfums, Wood Jasmine. Now this is a very interesting concoction of different, a lot of florals in here and fruits. And then it has some like amber, balsamic, it's a very interesting composition. And um, what I'm going to say, I'm getting to the notes and then tell you how I feel about it. So let's get that started. So. Main accords is amber, balsamic, fruity, wood, sweet, smoky, vanilla, white florals, warm spices. Now, I would say you get a lot of woods, smokiness, sweet. Um, the balsamic, you get the amber. The white florals, it's weird because it mixed with the spices, with the warm spices, so you don't really get the florals, you know, and it's it's interesting because when you first spray this, it just has a different effect, but um, let's get into the actual notes. Okay, so you're going to have to like plum here, guys, because this is a plum-dominated fragrance. And it's it's just so interesting. Okay, so top notes. You got plum and pear. And that plum and pear together is so interesting. Middle notes. Jasmine, Samic, Egyptian Jasmine, Artesium, Turkish Rose. Base notes. Peru, Basam, Incense, Madagascar, Vanilla, Spanish, Labdanum, Cyprio oil, Indonesia, patchouli leaf. Um, all I can say here is this is a weird concoction if I ever seen one. And the plum and pear is very important in this composition because you're going to get it for the life of the fragrance to me. That plum and pear, but the plum is more dominant. And then the when you first sp and spray this, it smells like, it, like there's some strong whiskey in here, but there ain't. It's that plum pear concoction with, honestly, with the patchouli, the Peru balsamic, and the incense. You know, maybe the Cyprio oil, the Spanish labdanum, and that vanilla, you know, could, could just... It make it just it makes it smell like it has like some alcohol in it when you first spray it, but when it calms down, you really don't get I don't get no Turkish rose, no jasmine, because the other notes for me dominate on my skin. You know, um, everybody else's skin is different, but on my skin, it's like a plum rum. <laughs> You get like this plum rum, you know, and then the opening is very, very, very noticeable. But as it starts to calm down, you start to pick up the other notes. But all in all, it, it starts to turn around to like a plum soft rum. And on my skin is very, uh, is very appealing, you know. But you have to like plum. If you like plum, this is an excellent fragrance. Completely unisex, you know, I would have to say. But on my skin, I get a lot of plum. The pear, you know, the incense, the Madagascar vanilla, the patchouli. Because the patchouli gives you that chocolate in this, and that chocolate, at the, you smell it at the end, but it's like, it turns into like a, a rum whiskey note, something like it feels like. It's just a mixture, and I'm not saying this has any rum, it doesn't smell like, you know, this is what I'm saying. It just, to me, it smells like a, a plum rum. Even though I could pick up the other notes, but when you're smelling it, it just smells like it has some rum in it, you know? And I, it's very unisex. I really like the patchouli in here, guys. And the plum, for me, I, it lasts the whole ride through, you know? Um... So if you like plum, you're going to love this. Um, for me, 
Um, I get a good, I would say, you know, seven, possibly eight to ten hours, seven to nine hours. You know, I spray heavy. I spray my clothes. So when you spray your clothes, you know, it goes with you throughout the day. Um, this definitely lasts in your clothes. So, um, but on your skin, you probably get that seven to nine, eight to ten hour, you know, around there. Um, good projection. Good sillage. You know, when you're walking, you're going to smell it. And, you know, even if you do pick up the florals, it just smells like it has some rum to it. Like, there's a spice to it. The warm spices. I'm telling you guys, it's like a, a plum rum. It just... You pick up the little notes here and there, but... <sighs> smells banging to me, guys. Um, My bad. Uh, projection is very good. Um, Siage is good. And I said the longevity is good. Spray your clothes. Always To me, I always spray my clothes. Um, but this is definitely... A sexy, sexy um, cologne or perfume, whatever you want to call it. Because this is obviously, this is definitely unisex, guys. So, you have to understand this is a unisex fragrance. So, if you if you don't mind a little bit of floral. But like I said, it's, it's not in here like that. At least on my skin, I don't get no florals, really. You pick up a little bit, but nothing where it's really, you know. So, hope you like today's um, content. Uh, BDK Parfum Wood Jasmine. You gotta like plum, and you're gonna get a plum rum effect because it has a bunch of other notes that assimilate that effect to the um, composition. That's what I get on my skin. You do get, you do pick up some florals and some patchouli and everything else, but I think in the air you're gonna get a nice plum rum effect. Guys, one love. Like, subscribe, leave a comment. Praise to the Most High, and we out of here, fam. One.